Hello friends, welcome to my channel. In this video, I will discuss about information technology important topic that is the online processing. What is online processing? What are the features? What are the difference between online inquiries? And so many, many more I will discuss. So start from the beginning, I will start with the example. Suppose railway ticket booking. Suppose current ticket available is 100 just for example and one ticket is booked. So in the railway ticket booking database, what it, what it will show 100 minus 1 that is equal to 99 should be shown immediately. Data need to be updated quickly. If not, we will get the wrong data. So as soon as ticket is booked, it should be shown 99. So updated, immediate updations is required. Now, this is the right definitions of the online processing the word online processing means we get immediate response as soon as input is given or you can say no waiting period or less waiting period so as soon as user is giving the input he will get the output or you can say no waiting period or very very less waiting period that is the definitions of the online processing you can see i am giving the input to the system and i will as as soon as i am giving the input i will get the output now here the system through which online transaction is processed is called online transaction processing you can say oltp system that you have to remember next features on online processing first one is record locking Record locking is worse, a database is there, user 1, user 2, user 3, user 4, so many users accessing the database, so many users book the ticket. So what happened? In online processing, it may possible the two people are trying to update the same record at the same time. To avoid these provisions of record locking is provided. In this record, under use is locked so that no one else can update it at the same time. As soon as first user, who is the, the user who is first, who finishes his work, the record is unlocked or fit for other user in the queue. First user will finish the work, then the second user will begin to work. And in between, the record is locked. That is the record locking. Next one is checkpointing. Checkpointing, checking which transactions are up applied for and which are not so it will just check which transaction is applied for and which are not rollback rollback means rollback checkpoint means before updations checking is done if before updation checking is done it is known as rollback and after updations checking is done it is roll forward next one is logging logging keeping track which transactions were actually applied and it will track only the successful transactions. So it will not track the unsuccessful transaction. That is called the logging. Next is online inquiries. Whether online inquiries you can update? No, only you can inquire. So online inquiries means process inquiries of the user. Whatever the inquiries, whatever the inquiries I am finding, whatever the input I am giving for a particular inquiry, that process is called process online inquiries. It is not like online processing means data will not update here. That you have to remind. No need to update the data or record. So inquiries, you will never ever update the database. You just fetch the informations from the database. Example, PNR status, balance inquiry, balance inquiry of any bank account. And each inquiry having you inquiry code. And according to that, you will get the informations. Next one is the informations will be shown on the display screen or the informations also coming in printed form. So ATM, ATM is a great example of that. ATM, you can find the display screen or printed form, you will get the balance also. So balance is shown on screen or or printed form it will shown on the screen or you will get the printed form macro it is a set of instructions which can be used to perform repetitive tasks 
so if i am doing repetitive task it is a set of instruction known as macro now sql structured query language is used which is more flexible than macro so previously uh, any type of repetitive uh, task i am using the fundamental things of macro now i am using the sql now here you have to remember online inquiry system does not do online transaction processing that is the major differences so friends hope you understand what is online processing what are the features of the online processing record locking checkpointing logging macros and what are the main difference between online processing and online inquiry inquiries hope you like the video friends and if you like my video then don't forget to subscribe my channel like share and comment thank you